Fight fans, so it is Monday. Um, Monday's almost over, but it looks like Anthony Joshua did not sign the contract for Tyson Fury. Ah, uh, guys, uh, it's unfortunate because this would have been a really great fight. This would have been a fight that I would have really enjoyed seeing. I would have been, I've been dying to see this fight. Unfortunately, um, the first fight fell through. Well, the first time they tried to get this fight, it fell through. Um, I can't remember exactly the reasons. I remember the second time they tried to book this fight, you had uh, Dante Wilder um, doing his rematch clause for a part three with and uh, Tyson Fury. He got it, and unfortunately, that's why we couldn't get that fight um, around that time frame. And now here we are. We are at a part three with these guys trying to get this fight together. I believe Tyson Fury gave um, Anthony Joshua until Monday. Um, which is Monday, and I believe he mentioned this on Friday, um, quite some time ago. Not well, not a long time, but a few days ago. And yeah, the contract has not been signed, and nothing has been agreed upon. So looks like Tyson Fury is going to be moving on. Um, yeah, guys, I am very, very disappointed regarding this. I am very disappointed regarding everything that has been taking place. Why we can't get this fight going on, and it's just a big problem within boxing. Honestly, guys, that's the big issue. You know, we know UFC and we know the MMA have their problem when it, regarding uh, money. Um, that's always been a big issue that we always hear around. With boxing, it's always been about why we can't get the fights that we want to get and why it takes forever. You know, it takes so damn long to get the fights that we want. And we, where it's always like, oh, let's build to it. Let's build to it. No, 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 no. Like, this is what happens when we build to fights. And unfortunately, this is the reason why um, things fell through. You know, we we had the ability. We had the opportunity. Unfortunately, Anthony Joshua lost a few fights and wasn't able to have that momentum. Being undefeated. Being both on the top of the mountain. Yet, it would have not been the same. Him coming off two losses. But still, it would still would have been just as good, you know, because now what if he goes in there against Andy Ruiz, a Dillian White, a Derek Chisora, a Dante Wilder, which, you know, Andy Ruiz and uh, Dante Wilder, those would be at pretty good fights. I would not mind seeing those, 100%. And, of course, all the other ones, again, no, would not mind seeing them at all. But, oh, honestly, I still feel like if he were to lose, we're never going to get that Tyson Fury fight. And I really did want to see that fight. I don't think Tyson Fury is going to give him that chance again if uh, Anthony Joshua just so happens to lose again. Like, this this is it. This was, like, literally the final nail in the coffin from these guys. And now this could be a bookmark in a match that we could never get because of certain specified reasons that we may never know. You know, when it comes to contract negotiations, when it comes to, when it comes to all these other uh, fights that... We want to see and it don't work out because of certain little details that should not really necessarily matter. Again, you're going to walk away with 10, 20 million dollars, if not more, 30, 40, you know, that's it. Who cares? Who cares if people walk out first? Who cares if there's some music, this place, this location, the gloves, the ring size? It don't matter. None of this. This is all little stuff that should never have mattered in the begin with. Shouldn't. So it's unfortunate, guys. I'm really disappointed that this fight did not go, is not going to take place. Who knows? Maybe some miracle might happen, and it might take place later on down the line, or some miracle might happen, and we might get that contract signed in the next couple of days. You know, because it still is relatively early. It's not even October yet. So who knows what might happen? What do you think, guys? Do you think this is what this is it? You think these two guys are ever going to fight each other? Do you think these guys are ever going to this fight is ever going to take place? Do you think this fight is going to somehow take place this year? Or possibly next year. I definitely would like to know what you guys think in the comments. Like, subscribe, hit that notification button. And I'll see you guys in the next video.